let's do an integration that uses a substitution. So I'm asked to integrate uh, 4x cubed divided by x to the fourth plus one, all squared there on the bottom with respect to x. So I do want to start with a substitution, and I think this is a case where you can kind of look at it and right away see an inside function that's really nice to use as a substitution. Uh, because number one, it's clearly an inside function, and number two, its derivative is sitting right there du is equal to 4x cubed dx. So when I do my substitution, I see that 4x cubed dx, that is just equal to du. And then on the bottom here, I just have u squared. And so now I just need to find the antiderivative of u squared, which in my head I would think about as u to the minus second, and then I can just use the power rule, so I would get a minus 1 u to the minus first plus c, minus 1 over u plus c, and then finally plugging back in minus 1 over x to the fourth plus 1 plus that arbitrary constant c, and we successfully integrate our function. So that's what I set out to do, but I just want to remind all of us at the end of this example that what we have here is an antiderivative for the integrand. So I'm gonna take its derivative. I'm gonna differentiate what we just got and make sure I get back to that original statement. So I wanna take the derivative of minus one over x to the fourth plus one plus a constant. Well, the derivative of the constant is gonna be zero, so I don't need to worry about that. And now I just need to worry about taking the derivative of minus one over x to the fourth plus one, which I'm gonna rewrite so that I can use the chain rule rather than the quotient rule. And so now I'm ready to take that derivative. Power rule says I'd multiply that down, so that negative one times that negative, I'm just gonna to get to an x to the fourth plus one, take one away from the exponent, times the derivative of the inside, that four x cubed. And I get four x cubed divided by x to the fourth plus one, squared on the bottom. And that was my original integrand, so we have found a correct antiderivative for this function.